No, I don't do social media, so I get all my information off Bleacher Report. Uh huh. I read an article today. You read something? I did. Okay. If you work with a damn idiot, they'll buy you out. <laughs> so, <laughs> if you, I'm saying, I read sure, it. I sure. thought. Sure, I'm just saying. I, <laughs> I, I'm telling you, Sha Sha Shaq, it's not you. It's not you. It's not you. Okay. It's not Ernie. It's Kenny. But apparently, if you work with a damn idiot, yeah. they'll buy you out. Okay. So I just want y'all to know, I'm open to the buyout. <laughs> the company can't afford the buyout. Um, I didn't know it was that easy. I, yeah, I've, I've never had a buyout. You hear about them from time to time. Yeah. I wouldn't know. I, no, wouldn't know. I saw it on Bleacher Report. It's got to be true. got to be true. Who didn't see this coming? I did. Well, if you watch Undisputed like I do, you'd be able to tell the envy, the jealousy that just oozes out of skip towards Shannon Sharp. See, Shannon Sharp is the kind of person where he just outshines people without him even trying. There are people like that that have that natural thing in them, God's given gift that they can't help but let their personality just shines out and it's constantly just outshines people it effortlessly without them even trying he's got a show the club Shay Shay show that he started not long ago and boom he's blowing everything out of the water skip has got his own show who, who watches that shit i don't skip has been in the sports broadcasting thing since the time of since ages ago since the time of jesus or something this guy's been there well right now shannon sharp has got the, the the ears of the youth people love him he's like a favorite uncle he's like the type of the, the uncle that comes to the barbecue and everything just starts jumping like the club don't start popping until until he gets there he's just that kind of person he's easy to love it's very entertaining he's the main attraction and Skip can't stand it. You can see it. You can sense it, sense it when you watch their shows. That's why Skip tries with, with every opportunity to like bring him down with little snide little comments and stuff like that. Try and humiliate him. And it's, it's ridiculous. So there's so much you can take. The mistake Shannon made was thinking Skip was his friend. Skip is your boss, Nick. He's your boss. Because Skip even says time and time again in his podcast or whatever that the Undisputed is his show, it's his idea. He's the main person, he's the main host. Everything that goes in the show is his idea, and nothing can go in the show without his approval because he has the final say so. And recently, Shannon has been trying to have an input on how the show is run, but Skip doesn't want that because he wants to put Shannon, keep Shannon in his place. But that can only happen for so long until you discover your pool, discover your self-worth, and then you're like, adios amigos, I'm out of here. And it's going to get rushed. It's going to get rushed by all this uh, TV executives, man, because everywhere Shannon goes, the crowd goes, the views go, the ratings go. Watch Undisputed, uh, Undisputed dump immediately Shannon Sharp leaves. Who's going to watch it without Shannon Sharp? He's the main attraction. Who's going to watch Skip? He's boring as hell. All they talk about is the same thing. LeBron, LeBron, LeBron. Tom Brady, Tom Brady, Tom Brady, Tom Brady. The Cowboys, Cowboys, Cowboys. People are tired of that nonsense. Talk about something else. Shannon was trying to input his two cents, but he wasn't having it. So there you go. He's gone. And he should leave. He is so vibrant. He's going to get lots of offers. I think immediately these companies hear that he's available. They're going to start throwing offers in his face. Offers in his face. But he should go somewhere where he's got the final say, where he's the boss. You know, you can't be a walker forever. But, and also, everyone can't be a boss. It is what it is. Adios, amigos.